Novak Djokovic versus Alex Dimonor is the fourth quarterfinal for the men's Wimbledon for 2024. And both guys have had different roads to get to this stage. Dimonor entered the tournament as the number nine seed and would take on the lucky loser Duckworth in the first round. And after three tie breaks, would get through in straights. 7 6, 7 6, 7 6. In the second round, he'd take on Munar. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6 2, 6 2, 7 5. In the third round, he was supposed to take on the qualifier Pui, who had battled his way to this stage. However, Pui was injured, which handed Dimonor the walkover. In the fourth round, Dimonor would take on Feast, who had beaten her catch along the way. And after dropping the third set, Dimonor and it would fight back to win 6 2, 6 4, 4 6, 6 3 to advance to the quarterfinals. Djokovic entered the tournament as the number two seed and will take on the qualified Kripriva in the first round. There's no problem getting through in straights. 6 1, 6 2, 6 2. In the second round, he took the wildcard Fernley. After dropping the third set, Djokovic would win in four 6 3, 6 4, 5 7, 7 5. In the third round, he took on Poprin, a man who had nearly played a five setter against in Australia at the start of the year. And this is no different, with Poprin winning the first set and Djokovic fighting back to win 4 6, 6 3, 6 4, 7 6 in his toughest match to date. In the fourth round, he take on Runa, the number 15 seed, who just come back from two sets of love down in the previous round against Ellis. There's no problem for Djokovic getting through in straights. 6-3, 6-4, 6-2, who advanced to the quarterfinals. These guys have played three times before with the head-to-head 2-1 in favor of Djokovic, with Dimonor's only win coming at the start of the year when Djokovic had a little bit of problems with the arm. So it's another match here where Djokovic is injured and Dimonor is having to face an injured Djokovic, but Dimonor does have some sort of injury himself. So it's going to be really interesting to see both these guys not at their best physically against each other. But Dimonor's going to win this one, he needs to make sure that injury is back to normal because it was really concerning at the end of the feast match, literally on the last point, hurt himself. We don't know what it is, if it's leg or groin or arm or it seemed like it was leg. If he can somehow get through that or at least fight through the pain and run, if he's going to have to run everything down against Djokovic, if he's going to be any chance of winning this match. Djokovic's going to win this one. He needs to just keep serving the way he has. He's been serving so well this week, which has really saved him from having to run and do those crazy sli you know, splits and all those crazy shots that he's used to doing. He saved his knee a lot of havoc because he's been able to serve so well. So he's going to have to serve well against Dimonor. And if Dimonor isn't running that much, being aggressive might be able to punch holes through Dimonor's defense. Very fun matchup. It, it seems like every time these guys play, there's always an injury on the cards, usually Djokovic. But now with Dimonor with a bit of an injury concern, I've got to go with Djokovic in four sets here. I reckon maybe Dimonor gets a set, but I feel like Djokovic, the way he destroyed Runa, I mean, how does he not make the final at this stage by doing that to Runa? But I'm going to go Djokovic in four. Who's making the semis though out of these two?